Gangs Nomads and other YouTubers. It is uh, Tuesday, October 6th, 2020. What an interesting year we've had. <laughs> um, yeah, we've only got a few months left. I think we can do it. So, um, uh, I'm currently camped in um, Santa Fe National Forest, about nine miles uh, west of the city of Santa Fe. And I've camped here before. Uh, LM, if you're out there and still watching, you know, thanks for, you know, telling me about this place. And um, last time I was here, I got a grand tour and shown all of the galleries and different things in the area. And took a trip to Madrid. Uh, those of you who are motorcyclists might remember a film called um, Wild Hogs. Uh, Tim Allen. Uh, gosh, I forget who all was in it. Anyway, it was kind of a spoof on bikers and that kind of thing. It was, it was a fun movie. And it was uh, done largely in the town of, uh, Mad is it Madrid or Madrid? Anyway, it's here in New Mexico and got to go see that. And there's a lot of uh, interesting um, art galleries and, and uh, some very cool culture in that town. So, so anyway, I'm back here and um, love camping here. I like the fact that there are low junipers and um, pinion pines. So there's nothing tall enough to cast a shadow over my solar, but there's you know, plants around and trees, tree-ish, um, to kind of give you, um, you know, a sense of privacy and, and, um, and some shade and that kind of thing. So, um, I've been camped, uh, up near my property for the last, oh, six weeks or so, uh, just to, in, on the outskirts of Alamosa, uh, Colorado and kind of moved around there and, and, um, and when it started to get cold, we had eight inches of snow there. I've got some pictures of it somewhere. Um, I'll have to see if I can't weave that into this video. It's probably going to be a long one because it's been a while since I've given anybody an update. But yeah, eight inches of snow. And uh, so it got started to get cold and, and, uh, and it was time to move. It was just, I don't know, I, I can only handle one place for so long and then I got to get going, I guess. I don't know if that's true, because you know I can stay in quartzite for months, and I will probably, which is probably going to be uh, uh, not my next stop, but the stop after will probably be in in uh, quartzite, La Posa South as usual, where I usually camp, and um, I think we're going to hit uh, Favorite Hot Springs, and um, spend a day or two there, because it's about 600 miles from here in Santa Fe to Quartzite, give or take a little bit. And I typically like to do about 300 miles a day. I can sometimes go a little more. I've done 600 in a day, but man, it just it's just taxing. And um, it's not fun, so I don't do that anymore. So I do about 300, and uh, Faywood is like right in the middle, so I'm gonna Make a beeline to Faywood Hot Springs and camp there. Love that place. It's uh, it's not terribly expensive, considering what you get. Um, the primitive camping, which is where I camp, is twenty-five dollars a night. No hookups, no nothing. Just back your rig in and you're there for as long as you you want to pay for it. I think if you get six days, you get the seventh one free. So, anyway, for those of you who are not opposed to paying for camping, and there's a hot springs right there, so. Um, and, um, you know, they're just good for sucking the pain out of these old bones. So I like hot springs. Um, so, uh, I'm going to, I got a new sheet of paper out and I'm going to start drawing here in a little bit. I'm going to, I've done some stuff and I've kind of really segued from, you know, what I've done traditionally, artistically. And, you know, there's been a learning curve and in the past I have worked from, References. Uh, those of you who are artists probably know what that means, but you have something that you look at, a model, a reference that you look at in order to, you know, see what it is that you need to draw. The stuff that I've been doing uh, for the last year and a half, two years, is strictly uh, out of my head. I, no reference materials. I can't say no reference materials. I'll go look at a tree and go, oh, okay, that kind of looks about right. But as far as, you know, the composition overall and that kind of thing, it's all been straight out of my head. So, and it, and it looks like that. You know, there's not a whole lot of 
uh, photorealism there, I guess. Not that that's a bad thing, I'm just, you know, that's the difference between what I used to do and what it is that I'm doing now. So I'm going to try and take it up a, a little bit, and I'm going to do something a little different this time, and uh, just kind of stretch myself. Again, working without a reference, so... And I'm going to try and uh, get some some shots of me actually drawing. I have no idea if you guys actually care about this or not, but, you know, I'll, I'll put this out there and see how it goes. But Other than that, uh, things are going great. Uh, my health is good. Uh, my blood pressure... You know, I have good days and, good and bad days. Uh, you know, I haven't seen anything like, you know, the 250 over 190 thing that I saw after my train crash a couple of years ago. Did I tell you about that? I think I did. And, um, but it's, you know, it's manageable. I think I can get down into 120s over 70s um, on a good day. And on a really bad day, I'm like up around 160 over... 85 and then occasionally I'll spike a little above that but blood pressure has been good my shoulder has healed up really nicely it's still a little stiff a little bit of pain you know muscles are still trying to figure out how to work over here and, but I can play my guitar again oh man it felt good to be able to play I couldn't do that for probably close to a year I couldn't play my guitar that was that was really awful so anyway um, today's video is going to be about the drawings. Um, I'll try and weave in some other shots of, of um, the Alamosa area, which is where I was camped last, and uh, this area where, uh, in Santa Fe, Santa Fe National Forest. Uh, it's just on the other side of the freeway from uh, Santa Fe, and it's, so it's close to the city, and, uh, and it's a beautiful spot, so I like it here. But hey, I think that's all I've got. Um, you know, any questions, comments? Uh, you guys have always been good about that. 